Hello, thank you for clicking on the video. My name's Stephen, this is Everyman Fragrances. I say it every time, but let's really try and do it this time. Let's keep this video short and sweet and get straight to the point. Aqua Essential Blue by Ferragamo is an amazing compliment getting, affordable blue fragrance that I have totally fallen in love with. Um, I picked this bottle up, this is a 50ml bottle and I got this for less than £30 in the UK if you shop around and I absolutely love it and amazingly so does my wife. On two separate occasions without asking my wife has complimented me on how good I smell wearing this fragrance. Now if you follow my channel you know that that is rare. The best I ever get from my wife is, oh, that's all right, or yeah, it smells like shower gel. But this one, on a couple of times she's went, oh, that's nice, or oh, you smell really good. And you know what I mean, that never happens. That is the closest thing I'm ever gonna get to those big old granny pants coming down. So let's, let's celebrate this fragrance. Let's put this into the Hall of Fame and um, let's just mark this day as Aqua Essential Blue Day, um, the day where a fragrance has actually garnered a compliment unsolicited from my wife. To be fair, it makes sense really, because all of the mass appealing compliment getting type elements that you need are present in this fragrance. It's got some freshness in the opening from bergamot and lemon. It's got a kind of clean vibe in the mid from lavender and cipriol, as well as a sort of manly cedar in there. And in the base, there's a touch of sweetness that you get from tonka and benzoin. So yeah, this has got all of the elements that um, the perfect formula in many ways, as well as Alberto Marias as the perfumer. So it's got the, like, the perfect formula to get compliments and appeal to the masses. So yes, it's not adventurous, it's not challenging, it's not breaking new ground. But that said, I am really enjoying the sense that it's unique in the fact that it's not Bleu de Chanel, it's not Versace Dylan Blue, it's not Dior Sauvage. Um, so yeah, it's nice to wear a blue shower gel fragrance that you don't smell uh, on anyone else. As I say, it's not you know a massively challenging DNA or um, it's, it's still a blue shower gel type fragrance, but it's unique in the sense that I've not come across anybody wearing this particular fragrance. So this fragrance is affordable. It smells really good. It's unique in the sense that nobody else is really wearing it and my wife approves of it. So safe to say, I really like this fragrance and it gets a big thumbs up from me. However, the only category it doesn't get a big thumbs up in is performance. It's not bad but it's not brilliant either i would say the performance is average maybe a bit below average projection wise is good um, i can smell it for a good 60 to 90 minutes um, with a nice little cloud around me um, so yeah the projection is not really an issue for me i can certainly smell it when i'm you know as i say in that first 90 minutes is a nice kind of cloud However, after that, it starts kind of wearing a little bit closer. And after about four or five hours, I can't really smell it. I don't get many wafts of it unless I smell it on my skin. So yeah, performance is not brilliant, but as I say, it's not bad. The reality is you'll just have to top up during the day. Um, this being a blue fragrance is super versatile. You can, it's definitely clean and fresh, so you can wear this during the office. So then you could just sort of top up at lunchtime and it'll see you through to the afternoon. And what I do like is the fact that it's got that, that sweetness in the base that, as I said earlier, it's not over the top, it's not cloying, it's just a nice sort of subtle sweetness that blends well with the kind of clean, fresh vibe. Uh, that it means that that sweetness gives it that little bit of attractiveness that you could then wear this after work, either going for drinks after work or going on a date after work. So this is certainly a fragrance that you can wear all day um, and it could easily become a signature scent. So yeah, it's, it's a winner. So that's it, let me know what you think to this fragrance if you've tried it and any other fragrances that you recommend that would fall into this category or from the house of Ferragamo. I'd be really curious to find out. Thanks again for watching, I do really appreciate it and I will see you for a video again soon. Take care, much love.